Good morning, good morning, good morning, Eagle Nick Audits. And I'm going in here to make a cup of coffee, and I'll be right back. Good morning. How you doing there? Michael Kunkel, the true spitter. Glad to see you this morning. First one in the chat. I really and truly appreciate you there, Michael. I'm making me a cup of that there chocolate coffee right now, partner. As soon as I get it done, I'll be right back in here, but I'd like to say a very good morning to everyone. Pray that you're all doing okay today. Eagle Nick Audits is in the building, and we got Michael. Glad to see you, Michael. Feel free to make sure you post your link into the chat so we can get people over to your YouTube channel. Now I'm going to go in here and slap that cup of coffee together and I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Had to get that there coffee made. Got my cup of coffee made this morning. At least I will have some coffee. Can't get no breakfast today. Lunch or dinner, as far as that goes. Greater Works does not serve at all on Friday. Still banned from that there Providence Ministries. A faith-based organization, they call it. Yeah, they ban people and will not let them come up there and eat. Where is the faith in that, if you know what I mean, Burn? Jesus said, if you've done it unto one of these, you've done it to me. 
If you would deny someone to eat, you would deny Christ himself. That is one thing that I've not been able to figure out about a faith-based ministry to ban someone without letting them even eat anymore. Of course, it is a for-profit. That is why it's called Providence Ministries Incorporated. I just think that it is a crying shame that they deny someone to be able to eat. Good morning, Braden Kirk. How you doing, brother? Glad to see you again. Hope your channel's doing a little bit better now. If you got them there uh, heist tags in your descriptions, if any of y'all were on that there rumble, be sure to check out Eagle Nick Audits 1967 on rumble, please. If you haven't already, if you haven't already, be sure to check out the description or in the title, I have the link to go to to register where it would help Eagle Nick Audits out on that Dar Rumble. Now, that is something new that I'm trying because it is not censored on Rumble like they censor you on YouTube. Well, Braden, uh, you can post your uh, link to your YouTube channel in the chat here. I'll be glad for you to do it. Good morning, Mile High Community Channel. Keep rocking in the free world. Yes, sir. Good morning, Nico. Nico, I do support the Second Amendment, but I do not own nor do I carry a firearm. But I do, I do believe in the Second Amendment one hundred percent. Eagle Nick Audits carries a rod and reel with a lure attached. Now, I do not own a firearm. I do not carry a firearm. I've got these arms. They're not on fire, but they got fists at the end of them. But I do fully support the Second Amendment. I support the whole United States Constitution. But I do not like that their constitutional amendment that gave them the right to make that federal income tax. Mile High Community Channel, be sure to post your link in the chat here. If I could get one of y'all to post Braden Kirk's link to his YouTube channel as well, I would really appreciate it. I am all about making sure that everyone has their channel recognized. You know, that is what we are supposed to do to be here for one another.
trying to help Mr. Braden Kerr Kerr get his YouTube channel up to 50 subscribers so they can start doing lives. I would truly appreciate it if y'all would give Mr. Braden Kirk a shout out on your channels as well. It is the start of a very, very beautiful day today. It looks like it's going to be a gorgeous, gorgeous day today. How you doing there this morning, Nico? Mile high, Michael Kunkel. Braden Kirk. Anybody else, feel free to step up to that our chat and say hello or whatever you might want to say. Yes, it is a beautiful, beautiful morning here in Dalton, Georgia as well. I had a little bit of trouble actually waking up this morning. I didn't want to crawl out of bed after them doggone stings I got from that hornet yesterday morning. I had to sleep off that doggone Benadryl yesterday. It took about six hours of sleep to actually get to where I wasn't so groggy and drowsy. That one hornet boy, it went to town on my doggone right hand, stung me on all four of them thar fingers. Luckily, it did not get that old thumb. And I will tell you, it hurt like crap. But it did not take me long to look at a hornet, if you know what I mean, Vern. Well, I took three of them acetaminophen PMs with that Benadryl because my hand was a really hurting. I mean, it was a hurting like crap. It caused me, I was actually doing the live stream yesterday morning when it happened. So it did cause some profanity to slip out. But hey, what can I say? When you get stung by a daggum hornet, sometimes you cannot help but to let out a little word or two. And I actually got stung on four fingers multiple times, probably up to two times per finger. Did not know what was going on. It happened so quick, I had put my right hand around a pine tree limb gonna pick it up off of my mother's yellow rose of texas rose bush and it grabbed that tree limb and then it wasn't less than 30 seconds later i felt something boil my fingers started hurting like crap i jerked my hand up off of that dark tree limb and there was a hornet flew out of my hand now that hornet was sitting up under that there tree limb and got in my hand and boy, it was just a stinging me like crazy. I guess that is how a hornet shakes hands, but oh, Eagle Nick, all it does not like shaking hands with them there hornets. 
I actually live firsthand to find out why they say madder than a hornet, if you know what I mean, Vern. I was not trying to hurt that darn hornet, but it was damn sure trying to hurt me. Amen to that there. I'm not allergic to them either, but I tell you what, that don't make them there stings feel any better when they sting you. Now that there Benadryl was not because I have an allergic reaction to them. That was just to try to relieve some of that pain because, you know, there ain't nothing else you can do about that there pain when you get stung by, stung by a hornet. Yeah, Michael, I wasn't trying to box with that daggum hornet. That sucker knocked me out. That damn hornet got mad, man. Like, hey, what the hell are you doing to my tree limb? Now, hey, yo, Eagle Nick Smart, though, I waited about 12 hours, and I went back down there, and I took another little tree limb, and I lifted up that dar pine tree limb, and lo and behold, no hornets. So I snatched that there pine limb up and got the heck out of there, if you know what I mean, Vern. Just trying to make sure it don't kill my mother's yellow rose of Texas. Good morning, Sasha Pitbull. This is 100% real, true to the core. We are not in no mobile home, but thank you for stopping in. It is as real as it gets. This is not Toe Mater. This is Eagle Nick Audis. And we are live at the Eagle's Nest. It ain't no mobile home and there ain't no mess. We got some coffee and we got some cigarettes. And if today is your birthday, well, happy birthday to you. You know what I mean, Burn. It's about time for one of them there cigarettes. Light them if you got them. You know what I mean, Burn. Hey, watch that talk there, buddy. Bro's got a big old foot there. I put upside your ass and kick you off my channel. You know what I mean, Vern? If my voice makes you want to do incest, you keep that shit to yourself there, jackass. That ain't what your old lady said when she crawled out of my bed this morning. Yep, your old lady said she she locked them thar hillbillies. Said she's gonna bring your sister with her next time so she could I could show her what a real man is. Hey, that's all right. Let them hate. Eagle Nick Audits thinks it is great. 
I get so many of them dar haters and race baiters that I've done got used to them. I was just giving that there little friendly warning because them there crocs, when they go upside them there buttocks, they go out in a bang, if you know what I mean. Now, I would have probably timed them out. I would have did more than timed them out. I would have gave them the time of their life. You know what I mean, Vern. Hey, I even love... I even loved them there boot-licking trolls just like the one that just had that time out, you know. All right, Sasha Patel or Sasha Pitbull. Quit biting on no Eagle Nick's nuts like a pit bull. If you had them darn nuts in your jaw, you wouldn't be able to tell me to take them out. You know what I mean, Burnett? I'll trans your gender there. Eagle Nick is not a transgender. Eagle Nick is a Bonafide hillbilly through and through. That hair there is real, baby. I'm all man. I'm not no man-made man. I'm a God-made man. I'm the way God made me. You know what I mean, Byrne? You can't improve on the real thing. Now, I believe in free speech, Sasha, but I also believe in putting my foot upside somebody's buttocks and kicking them off my channel. So if you actually like being here, I'd sort of watch what I say if you want to stay. You know what I mean, Vern? If you don't like this here channel, don't let the door hit you. For the good Lord split you. You know what I mean, Vern? Well, I'll be glad to oblige you there, little lady. You never let it be said that old Eagle Nick audits don't give them their ladies what they want. Actually give them more than they need, if you know what I mean, Burnett. But just remember, you can't come back. You have a nice day now there. Don't let that there pit bull bite you on the rectum. Well, Sasha ain't got no brain no more. Everybody say goodbye to that there Sasha. I guess Sasha was uh, doing something they shouldn't be doing with that there pit bull. You know what I mean, Burn? When them there women is so damn ugly that they got to have a pit bull, what's that tell you? Well, old Eagle Nick is a super nice guy, so I just unhid Sasha from my channel. So in essence, all I did was 
gave Sasha a swift kick in them there big old buttocks. About got my foot hung, if you know what I mean. But after I kicked Sasha out, I decided, oh, don't be a bad guy. I unhid Sasha from the channel so Sasha can come on back if they want to. But, hey, they've been warned. Good morning, Morpheus. How are you doing? Durham, North Carolina. Good morning to you there, Morpheus. How you doing? Glad to see you. Oh, Eagle Nick is in the great state, or not so great state here under the administration we got now of Georgia. Dalton, Georgia, to be exactly. Hello, New Jersey, old Jersey, a Jersey shirt, a Jersey cow. Shout out to all of them their jerseys. Whether it be, it be a new one or an old one, I welcome all. Eagle Nick Audits is an equal opportunity Viewer, view at your own risk. You know what I mean, Burn. When you come on to Eagle Nick Audit's YouTube channel, before it is done over said, and before it is said over and done, you might need some of that there preparation H, some Vagisil, or some of them there headache pills. So come prepared. It's getting hard for me to see that there chap. My eyes is getting doggone blurry for some reason. I hope it ain't no hornet snuck up, snuck up behind me and done stung me again. I do not know, Mile High. Why can't you? Don't let no cats in. I'm going to set this phone down for a minute, y'all, and I'll be right back. I got to go check and make sure they didn't know cats get in. <coughs> it is mighty hot this morning. Going to be one of them there days where be running on empty, if you know what I mean. 
Good morning, Pooh Noah. Meow, meow. That old hand feels a little bit better. It's holding that there 24 7 red 100 just fine. All the cats are outside. I'm like old Fred Flintstone. I like for my cat to stay outside. Now that daggum horny old poo, no, I don't know how it's to do, and I hope it got a bad taste in that there stanger. I hope that doggone stanger got a little wore out for stinging me so many times. It, I think that thing got me about eight times, twice on each finger. Hey, you have an awesome, awesome day, Mile High Community Channel. I really and truly appreciate you stopping in. I pray that you have a blessed morning, afternoon, or evening. Hope to see you again sometime. Them daggum hornets are some mean little boogers. You better watch out for them. Who's who's that there knuckle, Pooh Pooh Noah? That's uh, Michael Kunkel, the true spitter. I ain't seen no knuckles in there, except for them knuckles right there. Look at them there knuckles. Call me Mr. Knuckles. Yeah, oh, uh, Hunter Biden said he needs some money since the CIA won't tell him where they got that our coat from. He he put in a lost and found form saying, yeah, I lost my coat somewhere in the White House. Did y'all happen to find it? Good morning, Jizz Wizard. So glad to see you again, friend. Mr. Pooh Noah, I got something for you, brother. I think your name ought to look a little bit better now, my friend. Kamala Harris needs something there, Pooh. I don't know if it would be dope. She's got a horse life enough now as it is. Could you just imagine that there woman on some kind of drugs to boot? Hello, Russia. How are you doing this morning? Good morning, Sam Arkia. If that is the way you pronounce it, how about we just say good morning, Sam. How are you doing this morning, afternoon, or evening in that thar Russia? Now, in case a bunch of people don't know, Eagle Nick Audits would like to give out some of that public service announcement for your information now here in the united states of america we have that their american express card and their motto is don't leave home without it now over yonder in that there russia 
They have the Russian Express card, and their motto is, don't leave home. You know what I mean, Byrne? Good morning, Australia. So awesome, awesome, awesome to see you in this morning. It is a very beautiful day. Just getting underway. We are coming up on about 20 minutes until 8 a.m. on Friday morning here. Good day, mate. Crocodile Eagle Nick be the name. Just sitting here enjoying some of that our chocolate coffee. In case you don't know, that's hot chocolate. Yep, your name is now Blue. I hope that don't make you blue. Be careful, don't hit anybody in the head too hard with that thy wrench. No, it ain't Irish coffee. It's Eagle Nick coffee. It's some of that there Nestle hot chocolate. And then a spoon of coffee in with it. I make my own. So it is night time in Australia. Well, I hope you're having a very good night. Don't I wish, don't I wish. I believe I'm having some after effects of that there Benadryl. It's sort of hard to read some of them their names in the chat. Good morning to you, Belinda Hasting. How are you doing? I think that other one says that. Good morning, that. Oh, Belinda Harding. I'm sorry. I thought it said Hasting. See, that's that goes to show. Well, Eagle Nick ain't got. His eyesight is not up to par this morning. Sorry about that, Miss Reed. Good morning, Timothy. Welcome to America. The land of the free because of the brave. You know what I mean, Vern. Freedom is not free. Hey, Eagle Nick Audits loves them there Philadelphia Eagles all the way, brother. That has been one of my favorite teams ever since I was a little kid. Along with them there Green Bay Packers, even though I live in the state of Georgia, I've not really liked them there Atlanta Falcons since back when they had that there old Steve Barkowski. (laughs) 
I thought that there. Good morning, JD, my friend. Glad to see you again. Now, I thought that there Sasha Pitbull might come back. I unhid him from the channel because Eagle Nick Aldix is a genuinely nice fella. And I do think that there Sasha might have been a female. Eagle Nick tries not to be mean to them there females, if you know what I mean. <clears throat> if I could get my dog on left ear to unstop. Hey, Eagle Nick, I always would like to ask everybody that's in here, if you would, see if I could get y'all to hit that there like. If you haven't already, I'd appreciate it if you would subscribe, like, share, and comment on as many shorts, videos, and past live streams that you possibly can and or would. Be sure to check out Eagle Nick on Rumble. If you're not already on Rumble, there is a should be a link in the title of this here live stream. Head on over to Rumble and register. Good morning, Tyler C. So sorry to hear that you don't know what I mean, Vern. If you hang out long enough, you'll get the gist of it. Where'd you go there, Jizz Wizard? Come on back up to the chat, brother. Missing you. We got a bunch of people in here right now. We got Pooh Noah, Tyler C., J.D., Timothy Leach, Dat. We had a Sam, Jizz Wizard come back, Michael Kunkel, the true spitter, Abdullah, good morning, Uncle Sam needs new shoes, Mile High Community Channel was here, it said he had to go. Everybody be sure to check out Mile High Community Channel. Be sure to check out JD187 along with that there Michael Kunkel, the true spitter. Be sure to check out all of my subscriptions. Eagle Nick Audit subscribes to a lot of awesome YouTube channels. No, that is the Jizz Wizard, not the Jizz Lizard, if you know what I mean, Burn. No, I think that R would be a little bit ironic if somebody had to... YouTube handle Jizz Lizard. That would be a little bit TMI, too much information, if you know what I mean, Vern. How about we get some more of them dar likes? It's only showing eight of them dar likes. 
even if you don't like it, you could act like you did. You know what I mean, Burn? Now, you know, getting well ain't everybody liking the situation this country's in under that our Biden administration. Now, we can't do nothing about that, but we can do something about that there only being eight likes up there. All you got to do is hit that there little like thingy, my jigger. You know, it's not going to cost you a thing. Good morning to you. I cannot read what it says. See, we got two new pizza people. I said pizza. I didn't mean to say pizza. Sorry about that. Got two new peeps in the chat. Can't actually see them their names. See if I can get where I can saw them. Nope, that don't help at all right there. You picked a fine time to leave me loose. Wheel going around a curve. Oh no, ain't got no brakes either. Got a loose wheel and no brakes. Look out for heaven's sakes. We're going to hit the wall, y'all. It is a very, very beautiful morning this morning. I am super honored. Everyone has come into this here live stream. I thank you all. Please be sure to subscribe if you have not done so already. Now, Eagle Nick Audits is not AI generated. I am the real deal, if you know what I mean, Byrne. I am just a hillbilly. That's all I am, really. I never claim to be more than I actually am. My voice is 100% me. I have no voice changer or no kind of software to make it that way. Now, I do have some software, but sometimes my hard disk might get floppy. But you know what I mean, Burn. I know how to use that there RAM as well. When the hard disk gets floppy, just give it a RAM a few times. Because we are looking at a eagle and a little bitty guitar. Look, Belinda, that's because Eagle Nick Audits is a genuinely nice feller. That way I can say I had a whole bunch of good-looking ladies looking at my draws. You know what I mean? We could do an inspection to see what's inside them drawers. You know, if nothing else, I may not have no chicks getting in my drawers, but hey, at least I got some looking at them, if you know what I mean, Burn. I really and truly appreciate that there question, Miss Belinda. We could also look at this here can of chicken noodle soup. Now, this here is a awesome, awesome can of chicken noodle soup. It is condensed 
Plus, it does an exceptional job of holding that their phone up. It is not just a can of soup. It is a prop. It props it up. Now, this is my biggest fan. Now, see, a lot of people says, oh, Eagle Nick Audits is not cool, but every time I'm over here talking to my fan, I feel pretty doggone cool, if you know what I mean, Burn. Good morning, Philip. How are you doing, brother? We are in America. That is right, Burn. How did you ever guess that we was in America? Well, the eagle's been flying slow, and the flag's been flying low, and a lot of people saying that America's fixing to fall. But speaking just for me and some people from Tennessee, we got a thing or two to tell you all. Well, this lady may have stumbled, but she ain't never fell. And if y'all don't believe that, y'all can all go straight to hell. We're going to put our feet back on the path of righteousness. And then God bless America again. And you never did think that it ever would happen again. In America, did you never did think that would ever get together again? Well, we damn sure fooled you. We're walking real loud and we're talking real proud again in America. And you never did think that it ever would happen again. Yeehaw! Eagle Nick out. It does not feel like screaming this morning. I'm sorry if I made you scream. Well, I apologize to our partner. Oh, Eagle Nick is deaf in one ear, and I can't hear it all out of it. I didn't realize I was getting so loud there. I apologize. I hope you can find forgiveness for Oak Eagle Nick Audits. All right, we just got that there ear to pop to where I can hear a little bit out of it. I hope that there is better. Good morning. KY reacts. It is always awesome to see you, no matter if it is the morning, the afternoon, or the evening. Everyone, please be sure to check out KY reacts. Now, that is Kentucky reacts. Before anybody was to say anything, we're not talking about that KY jelly that has that that reaction to where it gets warm when you apply it, if you know what I mean, Burn. Good morning. Loves you, Taco. Bruno Mars. You want me to scream? Ah! Eagle Nick Audits. Yeah, I had to make sure we let them know, you know, they got that KY jelly that has that uh, reaction. Boy, that's a good reaction, too, if you know what I mean, Burn. But we don't get to use that stuff very often. 
We don't want them. We don't want them to get confused. They might feel like they're being abused or used, and then we might lose. If you know what I mean, we don't want to scare them away with what we say or how we act on this fine day. Oh, Eagle Nick Audits is just a poet who didn't know it. If I had a million dollars, then I'd just blow it. And when I got done, they wouldn't have nothing to show it. <clears throat> Pooh Noah, you bad boy. You a bad boy talking about lube the tube. But you know what I mean, Byron? We don't want to offend any of them dar ladies, but if any of them dar ladies happens to like that type of stuff, then I guess it might be okay, but I do not think they're going to come out and say, hey, I like that there comment. You know what I mean, Vern? Do you know it might be fun to go down one of them dark rivers on that dark inner tube? But Eagle Nick always found it more enjoyable when that there old lady would go down on that outer tube. Well, thank you, Miss Belinda. I appreciate it there, darling. If you don't mind, if you hadn't already, I would really and truly appreciate it if you'd hit that there subscribe. Be sure to check all, uh, out all of them there shorts and videos I got on my YouTube channel. Eagle Nick audits might get a little off the wall sometime, but sometimes I am almost sane, if you know what I mean, Burn. Eagle Nick audits does not answer questions. I'm going to plead that their fifth amendment. I bought it at that there Wally World, though. It came from Walmart. Wow, man, that's some good coffee. You know what I mean, Burn. We got 66 people. Well, it did say 66, and that dropped down to 58 in this here live stream. But I only see 11 of them there thumbs up. I'd appreciate some more of them there likes. Whether you like it or not, I would truly appreciate it. Good morning to you. I cannot read it. I can read the Gonzalez. Good morning, Mr. or Mrs. Gonzalez. I truly appreciate you being in here. Nesto, Nesto Gonzalez, good morning to you. Good morning, Jack Walls. How you doing? Not this early, not this early. Eagle Nick Audits could not go out and get any of that dar breakfast. So I'm just staying in here in the Eagle's Nest for a minute, smoking one of them dar cigarettes, just contemplating the day.
No, ma'am, Eagle Nick. Audits does not drink that there moonshine. I do not need it to have a good time. It's like that their song says, we don't have to take our clothes off to have a good time, but we sure could have a whole lot better of a time without them on, if you know what I mean, Vern. Good morning, Dane. Barry, I do not drink. I thank you for that their comment, but I do not take bait. Oh, Eagle Nick Audits is a fisher man, but I am not a fish. Good morning, CG Rooster LLC. Good to see you again this morning. Top of the morning to you. I try to get it inside her as much as I possibly can there, Dane. How's that? It's better inside her than outside her. You know what I mean, Burned? Oh, the can's doing great. <coughs> we got, we've actually got a couple of guests this morning. We got them there beanie weenies, the original. We got that there cream of mushroom soup. I, I figured I'd break this out for the one I always want to see, that mushroom tip. There you go, mushroom, cream of mushroom. No eagle nick can't help it that my beanie weenie gets all mushy when they're in the room. Let them there fine ladies make so eagle nick out its beanie weenies get a little mushy. Well, good morning to you there, Aussie lady. Eagle Nick appreciates you trying that our accent and to try to get it down pat. Now, Eagle Nick always wishes he had one of them there ladies to pat down, if you know what I mean, Burn. Everybody make sure y'all say hello to Miss Belinda there. Let's not be rude. We got a visitor from that there, Aussie, Australia. Good morning, Eagle Nick Audits. Cannot read what it says, but I love whatever, but I'm not going to take no bait this morning. I like a little bit of mustard on my biscuit. 
and some of them thar fried taters to go with that thar biscuit is pretty doggone good. What you do that far, what you do that far, you know what I mean, Barn? Don't be getting into my daggum biscuits and my French fried taters. I'm gonna have to get me a new bottle of mustard. I done used it all on them bar biscuits. You know what I mean, Barn? Eagle Nick Audits loves all of them their ladies. Even the ones that can't stand me. You know what I mean, Burn. I love everybody. No matter how bad they treat me or they try to beat me, Eagle Nick does not care. That's a big 10-4 CG rooster. You better keep your cotton-picking hands off of them bar biscuits, if you know what I mean, Vern. I don't see how them bar people over in Australia can afford to drink coffee or smoke cigarettes for that matter because I heard them bar cigarettes cost an outrageous price over there in Australia. Now, there was one feller said that a pack of them bar Marlboros cost his $45.00. Now, I do believe old Eagle Nick would be able to quit if they got up that high. They're already nearly $10 a pack in the USA. Yep, hey, they said them cheapest kind of cigarettes you can get are a $250 for a carton. Now, you got to realize that's $25 a pack even for the cheapos. Good morning, the nemesis. How you doing this morning? So glad to see you from the great state of Massachusetts. Welcome. Well, Miss Belinda, you just get you some of that there flour. You get you a bag of flour. You get you some good shortening like Crisco. You put you some of that there flour in a bowl, and you put some of that there Crisco. Or if you can't get Crisco, get you some lard. And you put a big old thing of lard in the center of that there bowl of flour and you just start kneading it all together. Make you up a big old d ball of, of uh, dough and then you just make it out into smaller pieces and put it in that there oven and you cook them till they are a golden brown. And that there is a biscuit. That is the key to making biscuits is flour, some good lard or Crisco shortening, and a little bit of milk.
Well, I'm going to see if I can go in here and see what that says. I can't really read it. I love whoever that says to as long as it's somebody that actually loves me. I can't really see it too good. Let's see if I can do something about that. Y'all give me a minute. I'll be right back. I'm going to see if I can't get to where I can see you a little better. All right, I'm back. Let's see if I might can read that a little better. Mary Lillis loves you. I, I, I hope I said it right. Even though you made it real big, it is still hard for Eagle Nick to read it. Now, I do not know what a scone is. The only scone I've ever known is when all them there biscuits are scone, if you know what I mean. When you ain't got no more, they are scone. And if you got gravy to go with them lard biscuits, they're going to be scone even faster. God bless you as well, my friend. Oh, okay. All I know is when you don't eat them all, they're all scone. Good morning, Andrew Johnson. Good morning, Ray Ray. Well, in the United States of America, little lady, we put jelly on our biscuits. We only jam on our brakes when we're about to hit somebody in the rear end. You know what I mean? How are you doing this morning, Ray Ray? If you haven't already, please be sure to subscribe. If you would check out all of my shorts and videos, you might find something you like or you don't like. Thank you so much, Miss Belinda. I really and truly appreciate that. Love to have all of them there people I can subscribe from that there Australia.
Well, bless my soul, what's wrong with me? I'm itching like a man on a fuzzy tree. My friends say I'm acting wild as a bug. I'm in love. Huh. I'm all shook up. Huh? Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. I'm all shook up. Sorry to hear that, J.D. I will be praying for little, little Bella. Now, uh, about every bit of my brothers and sisters, except for maybe one, has diabetes. Now, Eagle Nick Audits would like to thank my creator that I do not have health problems. I have not ever had diabetes. Now, sometimes my blood pressure might get a little high because Eagle Nick enjoys that there salt a little too much. I've never had that there Vegemite, but I used to hear them there men at work saying about it. I pray that everyone is having a blessed morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you may be. Be sure to check out all of my subscriptions. I subscribe to a bunch of awesome YouTube channels. Well, just the name itself sounds like it would be made of some kind of vegetables. Surely it's got vegetables in it or it wouldn't be called Vegemite. At least that is my perception. Now, Eagle Nick is probably wrong. I have been many times. Good morning, Mama Bear. So glad to see you. All right, Mr. Ray Ray, you have a blessed day and don't work too hard now. Make sure you come back if you can. We really and truly appreciate you. Now, Eagle Nick Audit's vision is a little bit blurry. I really can't see the chat all that great. It is a beautiful day out there today. Now, Eagle Nick wasn't able to go get none of that our breakfast. I will not be able to get lunch or dinner today either since Greater Works does not serve on Friday. But, hey, it is what it is. I guess that's why I stored up that there fat like an old bear so I'm be able to survive on them dire days when I can't go get nothing to eat. The last time I went to that there Hardy's when I had that money gonna get me that there two for five mixing match. Lo and behold, it was closed except for drive-through only. 
Well, oh, Eagle Nick says, JD, I'm sorry, brother. I appreciate that bar 32, but I wish, if you know what I mean, Byron, that Eagle Nick is a little bit older than that. Eagle Nick Audis, pretty daggum old. No, nope, Eagle Nick is fifty seven. Now that sort of hurts a little bit there, Miss Belinda. I know I'm old, but I didn't realize I was that doggone old. I can't change how I look. I can't change how I talk. If anybody don't like it, they can just take a walk. You know what I mean, Byrne? I don't try to sugarcoat. I don't try to say I'm somebody who I'm not. I am what I am. That's all I'm going to be. Because Eagle Nick Audits, yep, that's me. Good morning, HS. How you doing this morning? Not a whole lot of nothing going on this early in the morning. Just sitting here talking to my biggest fan. That is my biggest fan right there. It says that I'm always cool as long as that dark fan is blowing my way. You know what I mean, Burn. But right now, it's blowing on that dark eagle. I'm trying to get the air spread around through into the other room so old Chef Ben won't get too hot in there. Oh, thank you there, Miss Mama Bear. I'm glad to see you in this morning. And I'll tell you here, right here and now, y'all, you know what they say. You're as young as you feel. And every time I can get one of them dire ladies to give me a feel, they know what I mean. You know what I mean, Byrne. Now, it has been a minute. My wife passed away back in 2019. The last lady that I was with, I have not seen or heard from her in a 
coming up on nearly a year now. I hope she's all right. She was in a situation that she shouldn't have got herself in, but she couldn't get out of. I would say that it's around getting close to 80 degrees, but it should be up in the high 90s before the day is out. Now, it is starting to turn cooler. We are getting a lot closer to fall weather. Hotter than a $2 pistol. Well, the race is on in here, comes pride up the back stretch. Heartaches are going to the inside. My tears are holding back. They're trying not to fall. My heart's out of the running. True love scratch for another's sake. The race is on and it looks like heartache. And the winner loses all. Boom, boom, boom. Good morning, afternoon, or evening to you in Russia. We really and truly appreciate it. Make sure to subscribe if you have not already done so. Boy, it's got hot in here since I moved that fan around. I'm about to move it back over here. I'm about to roast. We're going to have a roasted eagle. Getting so hot in here, my feathers is starting to moat. Yes, ma'am, Miss Belinda. You know what they say when you're single, you're free to mingle. You know what I mean, Burn. It is okay to be single as long as you are not single-minded. So how is everybody else doing this morning? How are y'all? I have four adult cats, two male, two female, and six kittens. Now, the, all the cats started out as rescues to keep them from getting killed where somebody dumped them out. And the rest is history. When boy met girl, oh no. Good morning, Eileen. So glad to see you again. Steve Cameron, thank you so much for stopping by. Hey, that their work can be boring. Just make sure if you fall asleep that you're not snoring. You know what I mean, Burn. It seems to be them early morning hours that will make you fall asleep so fast to get you a big, strong cup of coffee, and maybe it will last. D. 
Good morning, Stan the Man. Awesome to see you, Eagle Nick Audits. No, actually, I live in the state of Georgia, Dalton, Georgia, to be exact. Oh, Steve, Stephen Cameron, bored stiff, I say. You know what I mean, Vern? When you are a coroner, I guess you can get bored stiff real easy. At least the one good thing about being a coroner is you do not have to take your work home with you. You know what I mean, Vern? And you know how it goes in them dark type of businesses. People are just dying to see ye. Stand the man. That is awesome. I hope you didn't get pulled over and get put on probation if you came through on vacation. We've got a saying in Georgia, you come on vacation, you'll leave on probation, so it's best to just come for one of them thar visits. You know what I mean, Byrne. Even if that thar visit turns out to be six months long, Never say I'm going to Georgia on vacation or you will leave on probation. You know what I mean, Burn. French Bulldog Dad, how are you doing this morning? Eagle Nick Audits. I am in the residence that I was brought to when I was a baby, so I guess you could say that. I'm still at the eagle's nest. Don't be jealous because of it, though, brother or sister. That happens to be because I and my siblings own this here house and all the property out to the corner. I'm not a squatter, if you know what I mean, Burn. Yes, sir. Now, that dresser is about 30 to 40 years old, I think. It actually matches the bed. It actually matches this little dresser. And the other little dresser over here is all part of a bedroom set. But now the dresser and the bedroom set is not as old as Eagle Nick Audits. Carlito, great to see you again. Yep, we got two cans this morning, two cans. That way we make sure the phone don't fall down when we prop it up there like so. Eagle Nick's got both hands free now, thanks to them dark cans. I can't see that dark chat while I'm doing it like that, but I know how to fix it. Check it out. Eagle Nick knows how to fix that real quick. All right, somebody say something now. 
Say a fecal napkin. That's a big 10-4 there, Carlito. Eagle Nick Audits is definitely not no pigeon. You know what I mean, Vern. Now, Eagle Nick Audits used that their head for something besides, besides a hat holder. Now, I will not have any problem whatsoever reading that bar chat. Even though I got both hands free, if you know what I mean, Vern. Yep, them thar pigeons is for the play. And they probably actually taste great, if you know what I mean. I'd say a pigeon is a lot like a dove. Let's see what Miss Mama Bear said. Yes, ma'am, Miss Mama Bear. This this home I'm living in is uh, actually the home I grew up in. My my father built this home. He also built the wall outside. There is a beautiful rock wall out here. Let's see if I can go show it to you. In case any of you have not ever seen it. Now, here is the front door. We got the Ten Commandments. Now, here is a little picture of Eagle Nick. That is when I was 17 years old. Looked like one of them there gangsters. I was a very young 17 years old. This is that there brick wall that my father built. Now this is the outside of the house. It is a pretty decent size. There is old Chef Ben's bicycle sitting out here. These are my eagle wind chimes. That is my cat TC. It is a pretty big old house. That is my little cat tiger right yonder. Over here is that yellow rose of Texas bush I was taking that big tree limb off of. It is still actually laying down there. I need to prop it back up. But I'm actually scared to go over in there right now because of that there hornet. I do not want it saying good morning to me again, if you know what I mean. I see one flying around right over yonder. Now, there is a hornet flying around. I don't want to talk to it again. It doesn't take me long to look at a hornet. Oh, Eagle Nick found out firsthand exactly what it means to be mad as a hornet. Now, that hornet got pretty daggone mad, you know what I mean. Them doggone hornets get mad quick, too, boy. Hey, you are very welcome, Miss Belinda.
Now, my left ear has got stopped up on me. I can't hear that of it again at all. I'm sorry if I get a little too loud. Good morning, Greg Davis. How are you doing, my friend? Well, it is a whole lot better this morning. It ain't hurting. I finally got all that there pain out of there. I don't want to mess with none of them there hornets again, if you know what I mean. That there hornet gave me one of them there hand jobs, but I did not like it because it really did a job on my hand, if you know what I mean, Byron. That baby stung me on all four of them there fingers except for my thumb. And it stung me about it stung me about twice on each finger. Now, I do not know what that there hornet got so mad about. I was only trying to move that there tree limb off that yellow rose of Texas. I wasn't trying to be horny or anything. My doggone left ear is so stopped up, I just can't hear worth a crap. I know I don't look worth a crap. I apologize about how my hair looked all messed up. Sorry to hear that there, Greg. Hope you don't get stung by none of them there hornets. Now check it out. Old Eagle Nick's hair, hair likes to feather. See how it feathers out? When I comb it, it wants to feather out on the side. It's like it's trying to make sure that I am that dark eagle neck and not somebody else, if you know what I mean, Byron. I may not be allergic to them dark bee stings. But I do not like them nonetheless. They hurt like heck, if you know what I mean, Byrne. Plus, it don't take me long to look at one of them there hornets. Oh, baby, let me be. You loving teddy bear, put a chain around my neck and lead me anywhere. Oh, let me be, oh, let it be your teddy bear. I just want to be your teddy bear.
I wish this dog on the ear would. I pray you have a great night's sleep, Miss Belinda. It was awesome to see you in the chat. Please be sure to drop back by sometime if you don't mind. Love to see you again. Pray you have a great night's sleep and wake up in that there morning with a bright new outlook on the day. Eagle Nick Audits truly appreciates you. Can't get that their ear to come and stop for nothing in this world. Don't know why it keeps getting stopped up. That their left ear just does not want to cooperate this morning. It's like I got peanut butter in my ear. I just can't hear, if you know what I mean, Vern. I can hear out of my right side, but not too very good. Now, a lot of people are talking about what America needs, and I'll tell you what we don't need. We do not need that. We do not need Kamala Harris as the president of the United States, dangerously liberal then, dangerously liberal now. She is dangerously liberal. She cut deals to let violent criminals off the hook when she was the district attorney in California, liberal California. She refused the death penalty for an MS-13 gang member who murdered a father and his sons. Harris even released a felon who then committed murder and allowed convicted drug dealers to escape deportation. Now that is all about that our vote because California has been allowing illegal immigrants to vote in their elections for a very, very great many years, stealing away the vote of legal citizens of the United States. We do not need that in the White House. You know what I mean, Byron. That is something we can do without. Dangerously liberal then, dangerously liberal now. Vote Donald John Trump 2024. Good morning, everybody. Make sure y'all hit that there subscribe button. Time to wake up and smell that there coffee, if you know what I mean, Vern. It don't take just a second to hit that there subscribe. Be sure to like, share, and comment on as many of them there videos as you possibly can. Them shorts and them past live streams. 
No, Eagle Nick audits gets a little loud sometimes, but that is because he is proud to be an American, proud to recognize his Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, who died for the sins of the world. We would like to thank you all for stopping in. If you haven't already hit that there like, make sure to hit that there notification bell. You never know when we're coming back, but we'll be back. You know what I mean, Byron? Are you having a good day at work, Mr. Pooh Noah? Are you working hard or hardly working there, Pooh? Eagle Nick Audits is on a roll. Now, if you need a quick snack and want to hurry up and get back, get you a can of them there Band Camps Beanie Weenie the Original. That there is some good stuff. That is what Eagle Nick will be eating for that there lunch here in a little while. Didn't have none of that there breakfast. But I will be enjoying that there Beanie Weenie from Band Camps the Original. Good stuff. Be sure to run out and get you some along with that there Mountain Dew. You know what I mean, Vern? Beanie Weenie from Band Camps. That there's some good stuff. And if today happens to be your birthday, well, happy birthday to you. This here is one of them there little Debbie birthday cake cream pies. Wishing you all a happy birthday if you happen to have a birthday today. Good morning, Johnny Appleseed. I'd like to thank you for planting them there apple seeds. Oh, Eagle Nick, oh, it loves them there apples. You know what I mean, Vern. Now, you slice up some of them there apples and get you some of that there peanut butter and put some of it on it, and you'll be in that there heaven. You know what I mean, Vern. Don't be scared, brother. It's just a can of Van Camp's Beanie Weenies. Nothing to be scared of here. All are welcome. You know what I mean, Vern. You should be scared. Look at there. I'll show you something to scare you. Kamala Harris. Woo, scary, scary, scary. Now that right there is scary. You let that there lady get in that there White House as the president, and boy, we've had a bad time. You know what I mean, Byrne? Eagle Nick Audits says, make sure you vote against Kamala Harris. Dangerously liberal then, dangerously liberal now. You know what I mean, Byrne? Well, Eagle Nick out 
it says the great state of Georgia has many of them there peaches, the kind that grows on the trees and the kind with two knees. You know what I mean, Vern? If you are hearing them there dueling banjos, I'd say run. You're in the wrong location. You know what I mean, Bird? Good morning. You are riding the Eagle Nick Audits train. All aboard. Clear the tracks. Clear the tracks. We're on our way. We're not coming back. Eagle Nick Audits. All aboard, all aboard. The tickets are easy to afford. They're free for the taking. Just come right in. Eagle Nick Audits is at it again. You know what I mean, Vern? Now, you may not, cannot look as good as old Eagle Nick Audits, but you can smell as good. Just get you some of that there degree, Extreme Blast. 48 hours is how long it says it will last, if you know what I mean, Vern. Just look for that there big old check mark. And then make sure you get you some of that there bod, man. Most wanted, yes, sir. Reed Bob, that is Bod Man. The Eagle Nick Audits has in his hand. It'll get you smelling like a brand new man. You know what I mean, Vern? And then while you are at it, make sure you get you some of that there Aspen. Aspen, now that's some good cologne perfume. You know what I mean, Vern? Now, the French might call it perfume, but old Eagle Nick Audits calls it cologne. You just spray it on. You know what I mean, Vern? Even a simple hillbilly like old Eagle Nick Audits knows. Just take off that there cap, find that little doohickey, and give it a slap. You know what I mean? Nope, Eagle Nick Audits ain't on no drugs. Oh boy, do I smell good now. Can you smell what Eagle Nick ain't cooking? We are having an awesome, awesome day here. We are just chilling out, hanging out. Oh, smells so nice. Good morning, Oak Leaf. 
Good morning to you, Oak Leaf 88. Great to see you. Well, Mr. Pooh Noah, that our LSD happens to be illegal here in the great, not so great state of Georgia. No, Eagle Nick does not commit any of them bar crimes, and neither was I committing that crime or offense of criminal trespass when I was exercising my constitutional rights at that their post office. Dang, Pooh, where you going, brother? You ain't gonna be back until that thar next Tuesday. You taking one of them thar vacations? Dang it, man. That daggum ear just don't want to come unstopped so I can hear. I wish that our peanut butter would come on out. My head feels like it's about to blow up. <coughs> At least it doesn't affect my vision anyway. It's getting mighty low in that thar chat. We're back up to 19. Glad to see you, everybody. How y'all doing this morning? Feel free to step up and say hello, goodbye, anything you might want to say. It is a very beautiful day in Dalton, Georgia this morning. Eagle Nick, all its left ears all stopped up to where I can't hear out of it a bit. But I would really and truly appreciate it if you would hit that there subscribe like, share, and comment on as many of my past live streams, shorts, and videos as you possibly can and are will. And Eagle Nick Audits would like to humbly ask you that when you watch my shorts, my videos, and my past live streams, if them thar ads pops up, that you would please allow those ads to play so that Eagle Nick Audits can receive a few pennies every day that is paid by those advertisers to YouTube. All I ask for is a little extra time. I do not ask anyone to use them their supers that I have. 
super thanks, super chats, and super stickers. And that is because Eagle Nick Audits thinks that y'all are the ones who are super. Now, occasionally, occasionally, rather, I have people who sends Eagle Nick Audits supers. And I really and truly appreciate those. I've actually had a few people that sent me money via Cash App at that their Cash App symbol dollar sign Eagle Nick Audit, spelled exactly the way it is on the channel. People who would like to help out with the channel are greatly appreciated. Now, I do not actually post that their link to my YouTube channel. Because I do not solicit money. All I ask is for people's time. You know, we all have 24 hours in a day. And it does not hurt to share some of that their time with people. Good morning to you, Mr. Hank Hill. Glad to see you. How are you doing this morning? Now, a lot of people calls old Eagle Nick all this. Bobby Hill, because of the way I talk sometimes. Hey, I knew that was a coming there, poo Noah. Where's old Bobby? You know what I mean, Vern? Burn. Welcome back there, Jizz Wizard. Glad to see you back again. You know what I mean, Burn. Hank Hill, that would be a reference to that there Bobby Hill on the King of the Hill, if you've ever saw it. Mr. Hank Hill, who sells that there propane and propane accessories, has a little son named Bobby Hill. I sell propane and propane accessories. It's a good business. Everybody's got to have that there propane to keep warm sometimes. You know what I mean? It's multi-purpose, too. You can also use it to do that dark cooking on them propane gas grills, if you know what I mean, Burn. You know what they say, no pain, no gain. You know what I mean, Burn. P. 
peace out, Hank Hill. Glad to see you again. Feel free to drop by anytime you feel like it. Eagle Nick Audits appreciates you and hope you have a blessed day. <coughs> All right, finally got that there ear to pop and maybe come and stop. Maybe I can hear a little bit better now. That thar Sasha never did come back in and say howdy no more. I unlocked the door so they could come back in, but I guess they had a little bit of soreness on that thar backside when they got kicked out. Now, Eagle Nick would like to do a little public service announcement. You know, there's a saying that a bird in the hand is worth two in the bush. But if you get one of them there hornets in your hand, they ain't worth a crap. You know what I mean? They will sting you, sting you, sting you. They are real quick to bring that their pain. They are more painful than an XO lady, if you know what I mean, Burn. Them their hornets is all pain with no gain. Well, it looks like there's not a whole lot going on in that, that there chat anymore. Mr. Pooh Noah, was you saying you're headed out, or was you telling that there Hank Hill adios? Feel free to step up to that there chat and say howdy if you would like to. Or if you got something else you would rather say, let it out. Shout, shout, let it all out. These are the things I can do without. Come on. I'm talking to you, come on, in violent times, you shouldn't have to sell your soul, in black and white, you really, really ought to know, shout, shout, let it all out. Give a shout out to whoever comes in that thar chat. Pooh Noah, Hank Hill, Jizz Wizard, everybody. Good morning, TKK Behavioral Studies and Modification. 
you know what I mean, Byrne? Hey, Byrne, let me tell you about it. You go over there to that there power company and you tell them you want to get on that there energy saving plan and they will put you on it real quick, fast, and in a hurry. When that there bill comes, you don't got to worry. You know what I mean, Byrne? Oh, Ernest T. Bass. That there Andy Griffith. It's me, it's me, it's Ernest T. I got a rock in one hand and a rock in the other. And when I see one of them there wenders, you better watch out, brother. Ernest T. Bass rocking your windows for a very long time. You know what I mean, Byrne? Roscoe P. Coltrane. Them daggone Duke boys is getting on my nerves. You know what I mean, Byrne? This is Barack Obama. You might want to vote for that there Donald Trump. You don't want to vote for that there lady right there. You know what I mean, Byrne? Dangerously liberal then, dangerously liberal now. How y'all liking Obama's third term? You know what I mean, Byrne? You thought that vote didn't count, but oh, how it counted. I don't know where my birth certificate is. I think I left it in Hawaii. You know what I mean, Byrne? I got one of them bar birth certificates. I just don't know where I put it. Hey, Michael, what did you do with my birth certificate? Now, my internet just kicked on and off. I do not know why it would do that when I've been in my, at the Eagle's Nest the whole time on a excellent spectrum Wi-Fi internet. I do not understand why it would kick off like that. I guess they are trying to do something to old Eagle Nick audits. Now, Eagle Nick does not know why that their TKK behavioral studies and modification retracted all of them their messages. But if you're going to retract them their messages... Why did you put them out there in the start with? You know what I mean, Byrne? Are you doing them bar behavioral studies now? Eagle Nick Audits generally behaves the same way. 
doesn't matter what you may say or anybody else for that matter. But we have been on here for two hours and 19 minutes, right at two hours and 20 minutes. I guess we are going to get ready to end this here live stream. Eagle Nick would like to wish you all a very blessed day. If you haven't already, please be sure to hit that star subscribe like, share, and comment on as many of my shorts, videos, and past live streams as you possibly can and or would. And when you watch my shorts, my videos, and my past live streams, if you would, please let those ads play so that Eagle Nick Audits can receive a few pennies every day paid through those advertisers who pays YouTube to place those ads on shorts, videos, and live streams. It does not cost you anything but a little bit more of your time. I pray that you all have a good time on Eagle Nick's live streams, and if not, I'm sorry for that. I am who I am. I talk the way I talk. I cannot change that, nor do I want to. We can't all be cut from the same mold. You know, don't try to be someone to make somebody else happy. Just be yourself. Be happy with it. If they don't like it, tell them to kick the bricks. You know what I mean, Burn. Don't let your happiness be dependent on the happiness of another. If you see anybody that looks like they are struggling or possibly hurting, don't just pass them by. Don't turn a deaf ear or a blind eye. You never know when that person could end up being you. When you could be lost, lonely, confused, and just know not what to do. I really and truly appreciate that, that Miss Christy Yant. Come back anytime. If you don't mind, hit that there subscribe, and then you will know when I'm doing my next live. Be sure to check out all of my shorts and videos and past live streams. If you would check out them there shorts and videos first you would get a better gist of how eagle nick audits has got to the point to where he's at now now when i first started doing content on youtube which is coming up on eight months ago i did not call myself eagle nick audits even though i've always had the nickname of eagle and a lady friend always called me Nick, so I combined those two to become up with Eagle Nick. I really appreciate that there, subscribe, Miss Christy. I pray that you all have a very blessed day, morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you may be. Remember to take care of yourselves and take care of each other. I consider you all a sister or brother, and that is not in the old negative way, the way people talk bad about old Eagle Nick audits. I truly love and appreciate you all. But as Eagle Nick Audit says, I love y'all.
eagle neck. Oh, this. I am eagle neck. Thank you for that lab from Texas, Christy. Tennessee original, a Tennessee girl. Glad to see you. Dalton, Georgia here. Not far from that our great state of Tennessee. It is always awesome to see anyone at all. Take care of yourselves. This is Eagle Nick with Eagle Nick Audits. I am Eagle Nick, and I'm out.